Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so today's video is just going to be a quick little Zara try and haul. So a lot of the pieces I got the other day, I purchased them in store. So some stores have reopened again, but unfortunately the change rooms haven't. So I just kind of grabbed everything that I thought I liked. I do really like a lot of this, except the sizing is off as it normally is at Zara. That's why I like making these videos. So even though I won't be keeping a lot of this, I have to exchange some of it and return it. If you do like these pieces, it will maybe help you if you're purchasing online just to kind of gauge what size you For reference, I'm 5'9". In most clothes, I like to think I'm a size medium. Sometimes I have to get size large. I am very curvy, so a lot of the times I do have to size up because of that and tailor in the waist, but just for reference. And I always keep my stats in the down bar. I'll try to link everything below. So first up, I was just looking for like a nice white blouse that I could tuck into jean shorts or jeans. Here in Canada, I find it goes from winter weather to summer weather in one week. So even I was wearing that um, that white jacket that I got from Aritzia the other day. It was so hot. Like I really do like it. It was just almost too hot and I never even got a chance to wear it yet. So I picked up this. Um, from Zara. It is a size medium. It was $39.90. This is in Canadian prices. And it just has a nice kind of see-through print. It's like a little flower or something on it. And it's just like a really nice button down. Here's that white blouse I was talking about. It's a little bit sheer, but I don't mind for summer. I think it's nice. It's very cooling. Um, yeah, and I just had these tucked into some Zara jeans from last year. They're tailored though, so they fit a lot more comfy. And again, you could tie this up at the front. Yeah, it's just a really nice white blouse. It would look cute over a bathing suit tied up like that. This is just one of those great basic pieces for summer. This would look great layered over a bathing suit as well. And it does fit true to size. So I picked up a size medium and it's perfect. It's a little bit oversized. That's how it's supposed to fit. It's a little bit longer in the back. So this is a great piece I'd recommend. Next up, I got another blouse. Again, size medium. It's also $39.90. It's a long billowy just kind of like a loose blouse that I thought would look good worn open with maybe like a little tank and jeans underneath. It does fit in the body of it pretty big. Um, but again, get your true size because it's supposed to fit oversized. The only thing I will warn about, which happens a lot of the time with Zara blouses with buttons here at the wrist, um, for my body type, I actually, I don't have big wrists at all. It's a little bit on the smaller size, to be honest. Um, from here to here, like my arm is not big at all. And I find you can barely get your wrist in here. And also the length from here to the armpit, it's always an awkward length. I don't have abnormally long arms. I just think something with their arms at Zara is off a lot of the time. Like I feel like if you have thick or like muscle arms, sorry, I said that weird, um, you wouldn't be able to fit into a lot of stuff at Zara, which is unfortunate. And sometimes even if you size up, like the body will get bigger, but the arm won't really. It's always weird. Like I've always just found that at Zara. So I'm just warning you, if you have thicker arms, this might not work for you, or you would have to unbutton it and kind of roll it up. But I don't like having to do that all the time. But other than that, I do really like it and it does feel really like silky soft and I really like the color. It's nice for summer. Sorry, this one is a little wrinkly, but I love it. It's just one of those loose, billowy, flowy blouses. Um, like I said, it looks great when it's done up. I even like it like if you button it right to the top and your hair is like in a low bun. I kind of like that look. Um, like I said, you could wear this over a swimsuit. I just think it looks great. Um, you can see though what I was saying about the arms, like kind of when you move your arms, it's just, I don't know, it's just like that awkward length, but I understand like just the shape of the shirt, the armpit has to go there, but it's just awkward I find. I wouldn't wear it with this underneath. This is just from area, it's like a bralette, but say if you had a tank, like a white tank, you could just kind of like wear it off the shoulder. Yeah, it's just like a great oversized shirt. I just tied it up in the front and then I kind of opened it a little bit. So it looks really good like this as well. So there's lots of ways you can wear it. 
You can also just tuck it up a little bit at the front. I find that looks cute as well. Yeah, it's just like a nice beige color. Sorry if this is a weird angle. I'm just like sitting on my little workout area because there's no lighting in our place. I have to bring the camera over by the window. So next up, I wanted like just again, like a little like flouncy dress for summer. So when I picked this up, I think they were out of a size medium, which I probably would have got. I So I got size large. It's $45.90. Um, I figured I could always belt it. It's a little bit loose in the waist, but it was actually tight on my hips and thighs, like actually more so my thighs. And I know I haven't gained any weight or anything. So when I was looking at it, like it looks quite big, but again, if you're curvy, I find some things at Zara just don't work for you. Other than that, it is super cute. Um, I think it would just be too big if I went up to an XL. So I will return this, but if you are someone that has like a little bit more narrow hips, I would definitely get this. I think it's a very good price. I don't know what you call this material. It almost feels like a fake, like buttery suede. Um, it's kind of like a muted gray black wash on it. Um, yeah, but it is cinched a little bit at the waist. But yeah, even when I'm holding it up, it looks quite big, but I don't know. It was just like tight across my butt and thighs. Here's the dress. So the top of it fits really nice, but you can see like it's very loose around the waist here, but then it's tight here. So I feel like it's just for my body type, it does not work. It's opposite. Like it needs to be tighter here, bigger here. I mean, I guess you could have it tailored, but I just find if you have very like wide hips or thighs, I don't know if this would work for you and I don't want to size up even more to fit this because then it's going to be too big up here but overall it is a really cute dress if um if you're in the market for one and you have like a more narrow waistline the back is a reasonable length too i don't have it zipped to the top just so it's easier to get out of but it does up just fine so this little tank, I just got it to go with jeans. It's 19.90. I got it in a size medium. It does fit true to size. I thought when I had it on, it might be like a little bit more billowy. On me, it's not. Um, I guess you could size up if you want more of that look. I just looked at the size large. It looked a lot bigger in comparison. So I think I would stick to your, um, your regular size in this. And I think you could actually wear it both ways, higher in the front. It's designed to be worn with the lower part in the front. It does have elastic at the waistband, so you can kind of tuck it up. And yeah, I just thought this was like a great piece for summer and it's pretty affordable. And you can see the back comes up a little higher. And like I said, you can probably reverse it. So next up, I got that bodysuit that is just kind of like one of their basic pieces. It's $25.90. Um, I saw it in a lot of people that were doing Zara hauls. I looked at the sizing and I didn't know if I should get medium or large. I went with a large, but it's too big. So again, stick to your true size. It does feel really nice and silky. Um, the top is double lined, so you can wear this without a bra. I definitely should have got a medium so it just holds my chest in tighter. So this is a little bit too big. It was a little bit too long, but I think I will maybe get the black one again in a size medium though. And this great looks great just tucked into jeans. And they also have beige. They had like a leopard print, white, a few other colors. So here's that bodysuit. It's just, it's too big on the top. It's not supporting me, but if it was, I think, I think if it was the right size, I'd like it though. And that's what the back looks like. The next top I got was also one of their basic pieces. I got size medium and it's $19.90. So it just looks like that at the front. And it just has those very skinny little straps. Um, it almost looks like a halter neck at the front. This was, I would say, stick to your true size. Because I have a bigger chest, it was like a little bit tight. But I think the size large would have been too big. I, when I try this on, I'm going to show you, I don't like how it comes out at the side, so I will return this. But again, if you have a small chest, I think this would look really nice. I think it will look really pretty um, against your collarbone. Here's that tank, that basic tank. So this is the right size. This is size medium. What I don't like, it's a little bit hard to see. The fabric comes out like this. 
to a point and it's open right here. So I remember getting another Zara top and it did the same thing. Other than that, I like how it fits. I think it's just because I have a larger chest. It's not laying flat. I think if you have a flat chest, it would be okay. Um, yeah, and I think the size medium is perfect because it holds you in there. You don't need a bra. There's the back. You can see it just has those really nice skinny straps, which I think is flattering for summer. Next up, I got a pair of jeans, but I'm dumb and I got the wrong size. Otherwise, though, I would really like them. I can't really get them done up. I can maybe try to show you in the mirror, but um, I definitely I want to look for a bigger size. So with Zara jeans, what I always do, I size up at least maybe one or two sizes normally. I don't know what I was thinking the other day when I got, because this is a size 8, but definitely... Um, I need like a size 10 for my butt and my thighs. And then I always get the waist tailored um, where I go. They only charge like maybe 12 to $15 to get them tailored. And then they look perfect. Um, yeah, so this is just called a Zara straight jean. It's high rise ankle length. So it was just like that nice wash. I feel like this wash is perfect for summer. It's frayed at the bottom. It shows your ankle slightly. And in the front, it has button down front. And I always just feel like, I don't know if I'm the only one that feels like this. I feel like when they have buttons, you have to sometimes size up. Um, yeah, as opposed to zippers. That's just me. But I do really, really like this. So if you're in the market for jeans, definitely pick this up. And again, like their jeans are only $45.90. Like even if you do have to get them tailored, it's definitely pretty so the jeans actually i could get them done up but because they're buttoned um they're just pulling a bit here so i tried them on yesterday i thought there's no way i could do them up but they actually do fit and they do fit perfect around the waist but i don't know just because i have big thighs i feel like i'd have to go up a size probably and get them tailored or they might stretch out if you have narrow thighs though definitely stick with your true size and um, these are size 8 us and yeah, I just think for summer, jeans this length look really cute with some shoes. And if you have like an anklet or anything, you can show it off. Um, I will show you the back. I think the back is very flattering though. Looks really nice. So there's the back. They fit perfect. They're not really even gaping at all. So I don't know, maybe I should always stick with this size and just hope that they stretch out a little bit. Um, I think they would be okay if they had a zipper in the front, but just with the buttons, I think I should maybe go up a size. And lastly, I just wanted to show you a pair of shoes that I got. They didn't have my size though. I thought these would be okay, but they're too big. So um, just for reference, I'm a size 9 US and I always get a size 40 at Zara and that always fits me. They only had a 41, but I held it up to my foot in the store. I thought it would be okay, but they're too big at the back, but they're really comfy. Like this part, you guys, is like a squishy foam right here. Cause you know, um, a lot of the time in sandals like this, if it's made from like a leather or rubbery, rubbery material, oh my God, I can't talk today. Um, sometimes it can cut your foot. This is like pillowy soft. So today I'm gonna go and see if they have um, my size at a different store. But I just thought, again, this would look great with jeans. Even those jeans I just showed you, a white blouse. Um, yeah, I just really like the silver color. And these were $45.90. So not the cheapest things in the world, but they do feel really comfy. My feet are a little bit wide and they were fine. Um, yeah, so I would definitely suggest picking these up if you're in the market for some new sandals i think like silver and gold are kind of like a neutral for summer and here's the sandals so they're definitely cute from the front again i said they're just too long at the back so i'm gonna see today if they have a smaller size they're so comfy you guys though it just feels like a puffy comforter on your feet yeah really really cute so that was my little Zara haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.